So, hello everyone, and welcome back to some more Dragon Age Origins here with Liliana's song. Uh, probably the last time around, because, well, we have pretty much gone already through most of the bad stuff. We also got the collection completed and everything, so... Sketch? I guess we made it. So glad to see you, or anything after... after last week. My thanks, too. I'll help how I can. Okay, thank you. Hello, Sketch. Thanks for getting me out of that place, Liliana. No market for a helper. No market? That Raleigh wasn't going to keep me long. A spy ringleader like Marjolaine painted you. You were going to the highest bidder. Maybe even the Empress. Oh dear, that didn't, doesn't sound good at all. <sighs> Tell me what happened to Tuck. I just wish I had been there for Tug. They did him first because he wouldn't shut up. Drove Raleigh's men crazy for days, laughing at them. He was stalling for me. They said they'd take my hands. Only way to trust a mage. Oh, sketch. All I see is red. But it doesn't matter. We can't fix this. Oh, that is sad. That is very, 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 very sad. We can do what's right. That's that's all we can do. <sighs> do avenge Doc. So we don't fix it, but we can set it right. I'm not sure I know what that means. As long as we try. <laughs> I don't think that as long as we try makes it any more clearer to him, but all right. Um, how can I give this as a gift for you, though? Or can I only give this indeed uh, as a gift from the other place? Maybe. I don't know. Hmm. Well, it's kind of a shame. I would think that Sketch would definitely like to have this. But I guess I can't really give it to him. At least I can't figure out how I could do that. So I guess I can't. Hmm. It does bother me though. I'm like afraid that I'll miss it then because. Ah. <sighs> Silas, was it? Yes, I had to follow. I hope to earn the good mother's trust, and yours. I stand ready to go after the commander. And this Marjolaine who put you at his mercy. Mm. Thank you. I don't blame you, definitely not. I had a week in Raleigh's company. That was enough. I could hear. I hope you don't hold that against all Ferelduns. He is not what we are. It shouldn't fall to the likes of me to say that. Hmm. Why were you in the dungeon? So, did I free a criminal? I poached some game. I'd have taken my lashes, but Raleigh doesn't like inconveniencing the king's law. He had me for months. For no reason beyond his own amusement. Huh. Well, bam. Great. I would not last that long. Is that what I had to look forward to? No. He ransoms important prisoners to whoever wants them most. But only after he's had his fun. Hmm. Well, you are very well trained for a poacher, certainly. How does a petty criminal get so quick with a blade? Former soldier. I was probably not too far from Raleigh during the war. Glad to say I'm nothing like him now. Hmm. So what do you intend to do afterwards? So you'll follow me? Where do you think that will lead? If I can end this, I hope to serve the Chantry. They will already know my good intentions. What about you? Me? Nobody cares what I want. You should. Hmm, that's true, of course, that probably Liliana should care what she wants, but... Well, I must go then. Thank you. No doubt Dorothea is waiting for me. I'll follow you where you lead. I owe you that, and more. Silas. Codex for Silas. I remember. Silas Godfred was an odd one. He eagerly fell back into the role of soldier. 
At the time, I assumed he wanted revenge. I would come to see that he was trying to be the example that Relay had spoiled. I'm not sure Silas even realized he was doing it. Eventually, I would feel a sad kinship. Marjolaine had often offended my profession in a similar way. Silas had been stripped of everything, so he had nothing personal to show his nature. But there was something about the way he looked at the trappings of the chantry, especially the candles. He was a stranger there, like me, but as a Ferelden he was not so far from home. It was important that everything be just right. Not because he believed, but because someone believed. I found that charming. So that is our Silas companion. Ah, god damn it. I was just wondering about this. I guess I'll read it one more time, but I guess if it's just in the campsite, then I can't give it here. Ah. <sighs> The stone lives beneath a lay. Hmm. Well, I I'll see. Then I don't I don't know. <laughs> ah, Pony Lem is here. I was already thinking that we already lost him because why would he not like to be with Marjolaine? Because Marjolaine betray betrayed us, but no reason why he couldn't be there with them. Him, her. I mean, still. <laughs> Like trying to find the right spot. Our Lady Andraste, blessed is the prophetess, his daughter, sacrificed to the holy flame. Mm -hmm. She's beautiful. I remember a statue of Andraste. There were many in both Orle and Ferelden, but I had never held still long enough to really see one. The shand of light would have put my younger self to sleep, but the beauty and strength of that figure offered strange comfort. I was too foolish for revelation, but doubt would bring me back, and there would be no sources of that. Mm -hmm. It's a nice enough first statue in the end. Still here for you, Liliana. I'm not quite sure why, but thank you. Missy, need something to perk you up. Road ahead will be a tough one. Len? How? Yeah, I went to ground when Mars Elaine showed her colors. Almost gave you up after the week. Hard to miss your escape, though. Lots of people thanking their Orlesian she devil. So, need anything? Uh, business uh, as usual for you then? You're right back to selling, even after all this. Marjolaine left me dry too. Pissed about that, but the payout must be good to drop resources like us. Hmm. You're saying you'd have done it too? Well, not to me, but I understand. That's the game. So that's uh, betraying your companions is part of the game too? At least from your understanding? Which is not, I think, what Liliana would have thought the game to be. Not to me, of course. Yeah, well, you wouldn't do it for yourself, of course, because, well... All right. Show me what you've got. Let's see then. What can I buy? What can I sell? Well, if I'm not going to be using them, then... Well, what things am I going to be using? I guess I'm having a different... I am having the bow after all, so... That's not really the thing to go and compare to. I can at least definitely sell that. And the command <laughs> commoner's clothing. And all sort of uh, emeralds and diamonds and the like. That's certainly at least the case. I definitely already had one of these for... Silas, right? Yes. So there's no point having more of them. That's just an iron ring. And uh, the rope that I have with you is the one with the regeneration, mana regeneration, so I think I'll be keeping that one. What's this one now then? Was it the one that you were using before, Liliana? Probably. Now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. This uh, battle dress of the Provocure just happens to be a really good one. A little bit more armor. 
a little bit more, of course, of fatigue too. Plus two to dexterity, plus ten to armor. A lot of chance to, yeah, let's just, uh, let's just sell that one then. Did Silas already have boots? Yes, he has. He has better boots. Better boots. Uh, I can keep those, definitely. And uh, you do not need a sword like that, nor something like that. So, and uh, to be honest, I never use those potions, so let's just uh, get rid of those. Hey, at least I got my freeze bombs back. Uh, let's just change the weapon so can I can actually see properly which of these would I want to use. Do I want to use this? No, I don't think so, considering I have the plus 30% to critical backstab damage from this other dagger, and I do prefer to use a sword in the other one, so... I guess I will sell it, even though it feels like... Should I truly? Need a present for the old boss. Let's trade. Alright, show me what you've got. Let's trade. And then this one too, because there's no one who's gonna be using it. Now it's just a good question, what do I exactly want to buy? Well, I guess I can at least get these. It's kind of expensive actually to buy those little potions. But I would like to get them. Let's see, ice arrows, window pets, staffs, different staffs. These are clearly better staffs, radiates gold. Plus 10% to gold damage. We don't really have gold uh, damage though with you or gold spells. Uh, otherwise it's great, but it's very expensive as well. This actually gives mana regeneration in combat. Spirit damage don't really have a lot of that, but again more electricity damage considering I already have that. All the electricity, so I guess I should be getting this one for sketch. Mana regeneration always great, and then electricity damage is more electricity damage. It's more and more of it. Those are just the normal boots, yeah. That's the one that I sold. Those are nothing special. Then it's pretty much these rings. And I guess possibly this one. It's definitely better. Half cask ward shield. Sure, I'll get that shield. It's pretty cheap anyways. Um, these do get, uh, give a little bit extra too, but they're kind of expensive for just uh, those sort of bonuses, like eight gold pieces. That's kind of expensive. Plus two constitution. Uh, it does make sense to buy some of these considering the other guy doesn't even have any rings. So, sure. Did Liliana have two rings? Yes, you do. That might still be a virtual ring. You don't have two rings, so if I have one ring that I could be giving to him, that would be beneficial then maybe. I don't really... But five dexterity strength and dexterity, not really the best. So basically it's just about then buying the staff. Yep, yeah, this stuff and then these, but I couldn't afford them all anyways anymore, so... <sighs> I'll rather not buy these, I don't think. I'll rather buy this stuff then, I think. Even though this is very close, so if I just sold a little bit extra, then I could give this. Training that modestly increases the reader's space attributes. Mm. So it could be nice. And of course these uh, potions are something that would be interesting to me. I don't know why I have these. Like are we gonna get a Mabari to come with us? <laughs> I don't think so, but maybe. Let's just sell these because I'm not planning to be using them actually. I don't really have anything else to sell. So I guess I'll just leave this be. 
and just get these bolduses and get these crater lyrium potions and that's gonna be fine enough. I guess I could get the injury kits too, just or a couple of injury kits just in case we get wounded and uh, we need to be fixing someone up. Alright, I guess that's fine then. I guess I could have one of these now, especially, but <laughs> I guess I guess I already kind of decided that I wouldn't then for the moment. What's in here then? Anything special in this room? Or is this really just a room with nothing in it? It's kind of sad. I would expect something within a room. Alrighty, alrighty. I just... I so want to not be able to figure out somehow to how to gift this as a gift. No. No can do, no matter how much I would like to. Well, guess I can't really do too much about that. Please, miss. No more disturbances. I wasn't trying to do any disturbances, Sister Hildegard. You work in this temple? I am giving my life to the Chantry, yes. If you'll excuse me. I apologize if I hurt you. I'm sorry about Alia. I wasn't sure where I was. It's not that, miss. What then? I was like you before I came to serve Our Lady. It troubles me. So many apparently that come to serve the Lady have been <laughs> in a similar situation before. I don't understand. I am no threat to you. No, I worry for you. Many come to the Chantry at a difficult time. Not all find their way back. I won't need to come back. I was the same. There was a lot of pain between then and now. If you'll excuse me. So yeah, you're kind of the same again as we are already and just... <laughs> Ah, everyone's just same path. That's the only path that you take when coming to Shantry, apparently. No one ever comes here naturally. Partially makes sense. Ah, revered Mother Doritia. How Marjolaine has secured Commander Raleigh as an escort to leave Verlden. No doubt she expects a reprisal for her various crimes. It would be a shame to disappoint her. Hmm. Well, I would have some questions. I need to know some things before this goes ahead. As would I. Who exactly is Raleigh? I know nothing about the commander. Beyond what he did. Commander Raleigh is a noble who apparently distinguished himself to King Merrick during the Olesian Ferelden War. Many on both sides have been reluctant to abandon the hatreds of that conflict. But if I had to venture a guess, I suspect he is also a miserable bastard at heart. Hmm. How did you find Marjolaine and Relay? You know a lot for an outsider in Ferelden. The members of this temple have been most helpful. Though they technically owe no allegiance to Relay. They suffer too if secrets given to the Chantry are not safe. Hmm. My actions could harm all nations ministered by the Chantry. Hmm. Interesting. So Chantry nonetheless will have something to lose even if it wouldn't exactly be the Ferelden Chantry. Why do the papers matter? This seems like a, a lot of trouble for a few papers. If Raleigh finds the support to act on them, the number of lives at stake would be considerable. But Ferelden and Orle are at peace. It might be more accurate to say we are merely no longer at war. Hmm. How did you know I would escape Raleigh's dungeon? I could have died in a dungeon, like Tug did. I recognized a familiar spirit in you, and I had faith. It is a strength you come to understand in service. I'm glad you didn't start preaching at the time. I hope I am not preaching now. I, I just wanted you to be aware of the tools you already had. If this is the last the Chantry sees of you, I have still balanced some of my shame. Hmm. So what about the other prisoners? A lot of people followed me out. 
What happens to them? Some will be turned over to the city guard, although the difference in treatment may well feel like freedom. Others, like Silas, have more than paid for their petty crimes. He wants to join the Chantry. Perhaps he wants a chance at Commander Rowley. I would not blame him. Okay, well, I am ready. Tell me where they are. Tell me how to find Marjolaine. For your own reasons, I trust. Do you want your precious papers, or not? Not if I inflict more harm in the process. Call it a concern of my trade. Well, I haven't quite completely decided what I'll do. I need to see Marjolaine. Then I will decide what she deserves. I cannot deny you that. But allow yourself to be surprised by what you decide. That is something I wish I had done for myself. Marjolaine is with Raleigh, seeking passage across the Waking Sea. I have suggested a path. Be careful. Okay, thank you. It wasn't hard to find Marjolaine. She knew I would come. It's what she would have done herself. As well. Well. Pathetic girl. You're in the heart of my Ferelden. What do you hope to gain? Listen to the commander, pretty one. There is nothing for you here. You betrayed me. So there is something to gain, certainly enough. No matter how much you would say that there wouldn't be. Yes. Uh, I wonder how far I have to be to be able to do that. Who are you? Probably not, oh, not that far. Aw, that's annoying. <laughs> they have to have that sort of a stun coming. Yes. When I have a trying to do my spell. Let's just do crew peel first. And, uh, well, I guess I'll just uh, change the weapon for you and then just try to go and actually do some back steps with this guy. To go. Let's now see about this damn thing. <laughs> Well, at least a little bit of damage to them. Not as much as I would have liked, but not sure if I can do too much about that. I can definitely do this over here, though. Yes. Uh, go on and... Uh, well, I can't exactly shield pass, but I can overpower. Then you can go onto the other side and just finish him off, or, well, it can happen just naturally like that. Seems pretty fine. I will. I'm not giving up this opportunity. Hey. Back. Strike your leg. Uh, Never strike going back. back. Okay, oh. seems pretty good. Really? <laughs> Time for some fun. Don't go there. It's not a good place for you to be at. Here. Don't go there. You know your own spell. Don't go into such a foolish place and location when your spell is still going on. There's there are others like me. This peace will not stand. Or they cannot be trusted. But on the other hand, you trust that Marjorie Lane who just brought that thing for you. So it's kind of like... Um, are you certain about this? <laughs> Anyways, more mana regeneration. It sounds awesome, even if the staff looks worse. From at least what I see from here, so <laughs> that's kind of a case, but not the end of the world. Mental and physical resistances, and yes, the better shield. Seems awesome. For a certainty. Yep, 
Lots better. Looks as a little small shield, but is better, so it's better. I wish... Can I just... Was I able to give it to you? Okay. I was... I was thinking indeed that maybe in here I can actually do it. Skill acquired. I'm not exactly sure which skill, but the quest complete. You gave Tuck's weapon to Sketch, who has promised to keep it forever. Honor in Tuck. Aww. She's with him up there. I hate that. Yeah, but at least you have Tuck's weapon now, and you can keep it safe. So, that is a good thing. But at the very least, Major Constitution is of course good. Like wondering, where did I exactly see it? Well... Mm, nonetheless. <sighs> I seem to be thinking that maybe I can give it like that too, but it was kind of weird because I used to the idea that I should be able to give it from here too, but I wasn't, so... Not that it matters too much now, but still. It doesn't seem like you ever actually are able to craft anything, so might as well do this. And you can definitely then take this too into here. And you have that one little thing. That's all okay. Guess that's the way we have to go. We can come here for a moment, I guess. <laughs> I guess I could try to supposedly do something, but of course I can't actually, but... Ooh, he is orange. She is yellow. Oh, we'll see what's gonna happen then exactly. When we properly encounter with them. Gather your party and venture forth, yes. Commander Raleigh wanted his own private war with Ole. All I cared about was to meet Marjolaine, perhaps, if I managed to read it. But I didn't manage to read it. Sandstalkers. Alrighty. Right. <laughs> oh, you are funny, <laughs> wow. wow. Payback. <laughs> Sad stalkers or deep stalkers. A fool trusts his eyes. A wise man fears every rock is a deep stalker. Dwarven saying. Possibly the strangest of all the creatures found in the deep roads is the deep stalk. Mm. I was thinking that they looked familiar. Oh, even more of them. Fine enough. Yes. Oh, there's gonna be a lot more coming in. Did you have taunt? You have taunt, so... That is nice. Not a perfect position, but okay, you know? To heal. Wasn't too difficult. But a lot of them, nonetheless. Lots of these deep stalkers coming from the ground to try to kill us. Nothing there, obviously enough, but I still wanted to make sure that I do not miss anything. Haha, -ha, I can walk here. You can hang out here maybe for a moment while <laughs> with the you both and I'll take you forward. Maybe there's some ambush to where you go being up there would be more beneficial. Well, there's, uh, there's certainly something there. Can we get you to Commander Harvin Relay? Train pronto. Okay, let's just uh, <laughs> gather our group and... Uh, Meet them then. 
see what we would need to do with that. Uh, this sort of a little circumstances of him freeing the uh, train pronto at us. Yeah, he's leaving, but there's quite a few trained prontos, so that's not exactly amazing. Been in shot. Yes. Okay, try to taunt them. You go behind. Can't get exactly in a great position necessarily. Actually, I think this will work pretty okay, though that's a shame that that had to happen like that. Ah, I don't like how that's looking like it's going. It's like, eh. You killed that one. I don't really know how I can keep you alive at this moment because you are taking a lot of damage. I'll try my best though. At least it was okay. Give Heroic Aura maybe. So you can do a better job. Try to do overpower. Just wanna make sure to heal you some more. Immediately. Some lightning to make it a little bit faster. I guess this should be okay when you can do this. Yeah, pretty okay. Now for the master of these beasts and Marjolaine. And the papers. Lives count on that. And the papers. <laughs> and the papers. I don't think papers are in the foremost thing on uh, Liliana's mind in the correct mo uh, current moment, I'd say. Not exactly the most important part of uh, all of this, even though maybe they should be, but still. There's Commander Relay. Harlot. Harlot. If you My men, you could have just asked. Well, you're giving them to me now, so does it matter that I didn't specifically ask before? I don't think so. Like trying to figure out how I could be putting this very well into there. Ah, the problems of camera angle sometimes. Eh, so difficult to try to aim all the way over there. Well, if I try to put it on top of that guy, I guess that will okay, be able to work somewhat. I hate stunning arrows. That I do. Where are you even going right now? Just do this to this guy. You don't need to go anywhere else, okay? Well, that's gonna mean that we have to do this again because <laughs> this guy's still even just completely yeah, taken over and paralyzed, so we're gonna die. That's really, I don't see any way around that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like I was saying, there's no way we won't die when that had to happen. <sighs> but yeah, didn't see them coming from there too, and then, well, the freaking fireball. Always the fireball. Only you wanted to hear that guy talk and everything, and uh, yeah, that was my undoing. Oh, 
Just try to place it there, okay? You put the shield wall already up. But if you wanted more of my men, you could have just up. Uh, uh. I hate that stunning arrow. Like, that's so annoying. And then there's immediately going to be that fireball, so... Like, nothing too much I can do in the moment <laughs> when that has to go and happen. And then just everything seems to be going really horribly. No even really point to do that anymore into there, I'd say, so... I will. If you're gonna go anywhere, just do this here against this guy because he's right there killing you anyway, so... Might as well, and you do not do what I'm asking you to do and everything, so... Yeah, we're about to die again. It's a stupid fireball, <laughs> too, to be honest, like seriously. And yeah, it's impossible to keep people alive in this sort of spot. I guess I should just retreat a little bit, but it's annoying to have Good to retreat. To okay, at least I managed to kill that guy, but now I can't resurrect for a long time and we are just alone with Liliana, so... I don't think this is gonna really work out very well for us. I can try to do some stuff, yeah, but... Make this Where did the mage go? You see, really just not even trying to do those sort of things now because we happen to be far enough. Do not go anywhere, okay? No. Even if you couldn't do spells, you, it wouldn't be worth it for you to go anywhere. Yeah. Let's just hang out here then, I, I guess. Because I really wouldn't want to be going and engaging those guys over there when... I would just like to bring him back alive. But this is gonna last so long before I can get it. Take so long. Most of them are dead. It's just the guard and mage there, but... It's not gonna be easy without our... Silas. The fight beside us. We can at least heal him a her a little bit even. <laughs> him, her. Nonetheless. Well, I guess because they don't want to come into here, I guess I'll just wait for a moment because it's gonna be a lot easier if I don't need to think of going there immediately in this situation. Those guys who were shooting at us are dead and the couple of guys that were trying to charge us. Or the one guy at the very least. Eh, still lagging so long. Well, at least you can also recharge your mana during this time, so... I guess that's the winning side over all of this. In all of this. Well, just waiting a little bit longer. The music is nice enough at the very least while we are waiting. Waiting for this. If only I could already click. Well, they still are not... Well, now he came in here. That's fine enough then, I guess. Yeah, you both suffered a little bit. Magic, that's not too bad, I guess. And then you have the penalty to cunning. I kind of feel I should be removing that, but I guess that can wait for a bit at least. Before worrying about that. Yeah. Well, let's go then. When I move into here with yeah. you two, if possible, that would be sweet. Right. Because I want to be able to start doing something about that mage, okay? So can I get the zoom out of this, please? <laughs> it's super difficult sometimes to get that done, especially in this sort of location. Ah. 
Okay, let me be. Mage. Well, slightly looks almost like Moon. I wasn't trying to do that sort of a thing. I guess I could just... Well, I don't know. I guess you can stay here to fight against this guy. And uh, you can just uh, go ahead and uh, get yes. this lightning done. Got it. I'm glad you did the fireball there, so you hit only one person currently. I don't know about doing that, to be honest. <laughs> I hate that so much. She's doing something that I really wouldn't want her to be doing. Actually, you're gonna be the fastest to try to stop her in this current moment. Needed to be done. Even if it was not exactly fun or something I would have wanted to worry about right there and then, but it just had to be done. Just come here right now, to be honest. Because, yeah, I don't want her casting any more of those sort of spells. If I can do anything to stop that. Okay, that's better. Ah, that's a lot better. I tried to say that come and close enough so you can actually do that shooting, but very tired of playing games with Commander Raleigh. Mm, I can understand that. Heaven's frat. Well, now I kind of <laughs> am sad that I bought the staff that I did for you, considering this seems to be pretty much like almost at least just as good, so it's like eh it's even to some degree better. After all, it's not like I need spirit damage, so the plus 10 spirit damage is like, doesn't really matter. Spell power the same, mana regeneration the same, electricity damage the same, only spirit damage is more. Damage is no, just overall no, more in this Heaven's Wrath, and then yeah. Then not minus one build power, so I guess I'll use the Heaven's Wrath then. At least it's a little bit nicer looking stuff, I guess, but... God damn it. I just bought the other stuff. Kind of annoying when those are in, is for sale and then immediately on this just journey you find a better one anyways. So it's like, ah, <sighs> damn it. So that seems to be indeed the correct location to go. So let me just check if there's anything in here. Yeah, can't go there. So nothing over there, clearly. Okay. Let's just then get forward. I guess I could maybe cure your injury and then just uh, not start curing Silas's injury yet. I guess not yet, just in case I wanna save. Commander Raleigh. Yes, Commander Raleigh something something. Well, it's definitely already we're getting into the bridge where they were at, so it definitely isn't gonna be a very long way no more. Like, uh, in no way can it be very long. I guess I can have only shield cover or shield wall, so I should try to keep the shield wall on then. Yes. Enough. Got it. I hate scatter shots. Absolutely hate them. Overpower that goddamn guy. You continue with your damn lightning. Maybe this time around you could actually cast it. From shadow to your heart. Right. Time for some fun. No really point in any of Everyone this anymore. Gather around for a hug. For a hawk, because we're about to get to Harvin and Marjolaine, is that the reason? <laughs> There's a mage 
I hate those mages so much. I would really wish that I didn't have to have mages around here. I still have these two. Still haven't done anything of it with them other than that one time when I also killed myself, so that was cool. Okay, alright, let's go. Be murdered by this freaking mage. Unruly girl, let me demonstrate how one properly controls a pet. Uh, I have no idea what's going exactly. Trakon? We're actually gonna be fighting a Trakon here? That's uh. That doesn't sound fun. Unruly. Well, a small truck on, but the truck on regardless. Seems to be working out well enough. Let's make this last. Don't like that stun. And I don't like the what he's doing right now, but again, not too much I can do about that right away. I would just have to hope that somehow I would manage to keep him alive through that. Unlikely, however, that it is. Did we actually kill him now? Not really sure what happens or happened. Okay, he just like kind of like disappeared. Well, if I can't be without fighting him yet, then okay, he's not gone. I was very confused <laughs> because he just disappeared and I didn't really see him go away, but I guess he did. Yes. <laughs> oh, you are funny. One you are. Mm -hmm. Didn't really see that very well. I will. Oh, I'm not. I like wondering, should I use Maybe. a healing potion? But I think I'll just yeah, try to do easily. this first. I probably would have to save some of your mana, considering those guys, but on the other hand, I guess I could probably do this. Okay, heal some more quickly, you change the weapons. Okay. I was wondering, can we be normally without immediately a fight? But we can't. Spine, Pitch, Bone, Olysian 4. Ah, goddammit, where was the codex? What was my codex? No idea what would be the newest one. About the dragon, yes, okay. Well, I'll read about dragons some other time. Not right now. <sighs> I hate the mage. We have to get rid of the mage first, nonetheless, before anything else. Or before we can worry about anything else. Okay. She's doing spells from there, but that's okay, I guess, for the moment. And I'm being at least we did some extra. Uh, annoyances for her there. Where are we going exactly? I wish I could do some other stuff to uh, stop her from doing something, whatever she's planning to do. <laughs> yeah. so you resisted and you got stunned. Okay, let's just kill her. As soon as possible, that is. Good to go. Just take the other weapons and uh, go do dirty fighting so that we can actually go and uh, get this mage. Finest. 
No running. That's important regardless. We, at least we got him, even if it wasn't really amazingly great, but we got him. No hiding. You can use this. And you can definitely use one of these Crater Lyrium potions when you get up. It's done. I think this is the one that gives him health when he loses too much, but I can't really do too much about that then. The lightning, at least, we're gonna do always. You do heroic offense for Liliana. No mercy. And, uh, yeah. Then I guess we'll just try to do some killing. It's not doing anything for a moment, which is kind of confusing to me, <laughs> to be honest. Okay, now he started to do again. I don't like you going and uh, engaging her. Like at all. Ah, I can't exactly do actually the one that I would have liked to do, as in the Mind Palace, so we could have stunned him a bit. But that was not a possibility. We do still have a pretty good chance of stunning or like uh, avoiding attacks, which is pretty sweet. Now you can do the Mind Blast at least. Yep, you can do this. Just get some more extra damage on the Commander Raleigh. I would really love if you could <laughs> engage him. You can disengage, but you can't do this because it's insufficient stamina. Yeah. Can't really do too much about that, though. I guess I could use one of these because I have it. We're doing okay anyways at the moment, so... Why not? No, uh, I was meaning to heal her. Never going back! Mm. My turn. Use a Lurian potion. So we can do more healing and everything. You're better than Marjolaine said. The Bards of Orle have earned their reputation. But I remember the scared little girl in my cell. Well, maybe you do. Silas, he's yours. Silas did want to be killing her, him, especially after all. I won't kill you. I'm not that selfish. He wasn't. Uh, for that. You're welcome, Silas. Maybe I should have talked first more with him, but to be honest, I wasn't sure if one of those would go and take us to immediately killing him or not. And then just, just overall unsure of it. All this. And doing every one of these lives. It's more fun when it's personal. Uh huh. I wonder, what did the lovely mother offer for her papers? Something as entertaining as what I did to get them? No. This is about your betrayal. The papers don't matter. I take them back for nothing. Then I was right to think you were dangerous. Don't turn this around on me. What you did was inexcusable. Once you started to question, it was only a matter of time before you would betray me. That's what I would have done. So I did it first. We are the same. No. No. So you say, but here you are, weapon in hand. <sighs> we 
We did think about revenge, certainly enough, very much, but do we still think of revenge? Like, I can understand her concern about the fact that, okay, like, of course, like, yeah, if we don't believe into her cause anymore, there would be a chance that uh, someone would betray her. And maybe that's something that has happened to her previously, that people have betrayed her in a similar position. I cannot say, but Liliana all the time said that she was completely loyal to Marsha Lane. I never got the feeling from Liliana that she would ever been able to consider betraying Marsha Lane, like at all. No matter if she was un thinking that it wasn't right to take those papers or something like that, regardless. <sighs> what do we want? I'm not doing this anymore, which just mean basically that, uh, to me at least, that we're not gonna be killing her. I pity you. Isn't it just uh, then that uh, we're not gonna become like her, we're not gonna be like her, and I pity that she thinks the way she does. Which would seem logical enough of a thinking. I want what is right, not her ends, is also okay. That at least would be taking Liliana into a better direction too, rather than just thinking about revenge. So, and to be honest, it's not like there's uh, even a lot of possibility here to think about revenge. So yeah, I think we pity her that she can't trust us, couldn't, can't trust anyone. You see your own distrust on every face. Did I ever know you? If this was reversed, you'd wake every day expecting my blade. Marjolaine, we are the same. That is what you believe. Just so, so, so strongly. Do you want to know a secret? Yes. That moment I keep, because even now, I don't know what ending serves best. Did you kill her? Did you let her go? Whatever happened to Marsha Lane, that is the secret part. But being able to choose, that is the truth of this story. The rest, it changes with the audience. All things change when they find purpose. Alrighty, so achievement unlocked, turning point, and completing Liliana's song. So it was pretty nice seeing exactly what happened, or well, most of what happened, what led to Liliana joining the Chantry, basically, even if we don't exactly know what was the result between us and Marshall Lane, as in, <laughs> that's the part that Liliana is keeping as a secret, did she, what did she do? But, um, yeah, they, they weren't the same, in a sense, because I don't think, well, Liliana definitely would never, ever, ever want to become like that. That's a certainty. She would never, ever wish to be like that. And some pictures here at the background but hey that was a nice enough little, little story that i had never played before so i hope you enjoyed liliana's song here in between well after we had met liliana and uh, then we are gonna be continuing with the main game again and to be honest i played a little bit more of the main game before i came to here but uh, i hadn't yet uploaded the video so hey it, i thought that this would be fun to put into this spot um something new anyways something completely new so hey i hope you guys enjoyed i'm like wondering should i listen to this to the end the credit song too because it's nonetheless a short story so should is there really need to listen to all of it the pictures are nice enough like uh, some of the concept art overall but i don't think these are all specifically from liliana's song like i don't think we met anything like that exactly so and the song is nice
I guess I let the Great Zone nonetheless play through. It's usually what I always do anyway, so... It just seems right. And I guess it wasn't even that long, at least it seems like it's already about to end, so... And just watch uh, the concept art if you've never seen it before, and uh, enjoy the music. And so we are done with uh, Liliana's song, so indeed, next time, continuing with the main game, I hope you enjoyed Liliana's song, and I'll see you for more next time around. Bye bye till then. To be continued with Kidarusha next time in Dragon Age.